this amazing feast. So today I have made pork curry, a cashew curry, a plant curry with condiments, and fried hub. Georgia, I have a question. Can we eat now? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Oh. Bye, Georgie. This is an utter triumph. I could never have guessed that this was cooked by an 11-year-old. This fatty, rich, spice-driven pork number has so much guts about it. The real surprise for me is the eggplant, the onion, the mustard, the vinegar. There is a bitterness there that ties everything together. The beautiful colours and the vibrancy. That, for me, is fancy. She has nailed this. Those cashews. Turmeric is just earthy and it just settles everything. Rice, perfect. Cucumber yogurt, really fresh. I'm jealous. I'm actually jealous. <laughs> because you can just go, Georgia, <laughs> let's do curry night. I was eating this and thinking, uh, this is my mum's food. And I, I, I can't believe my daughter's made it. Mm. And. Um, so special that she is cooking the food that I love eating, that, that my mum makes. Georgia's always said that she cooks to show her love and that's how she expresses her feelings. And that's exactly what my mum is like as well. It's just wonderful. It, it means a lot to me. You have just won $25,000 and the title of Junior Master Chef 2020. Georgia, there's only one thing left for you to do. You need to turn around, take a short walk, and lift that trophy above your head. Are you ready? Do you think you can do it? Yes, you can. Come on. Oh. Don't do it.